artifacts from Mars. And in Colorado, the Republican Party did something which is really going to hurt them. Get the kids out of the room. My language is likely to be raw. I am seriously angry. They'll be lucky if I ever, ever vote for one of these pieces of shit again. They're as bad as the Democrats. What they did, you got the kids out of the room, because this is not going to be pretty, I guarantee you that. What they did is they basically said, Ted Cruz gets all delegates here, screw you voters. That's right, not a single vote was cast. I'm sure uh, everybody here knows that by now. If you don't, you just learned it. Not a single vote was cast. They just said, eh, Cruz is a winner. Let's move along. Well, the uh, fallout from that is going to be nasty. Uh, hashtag never Trump is elated, of course. But let's take a look at an email that came from Trump supporter. I guess you haven't learned your lesson. You saw what we did in the state Senate president who betrayed us and voted for the anti Second Amendment bills. We recalled her. What do you think we'll do for selling? us out and join the never, never Trump cabal. Let me abundantly clear there, so there's no mistake. We will burn the whole fucking party to the ground on election day. We will do one of three things. Stay home, vote for third party candidates, ones who don't have a chance of winning, or cast our lot with the despicable Democrats and destroy the GOP for a generation. It'll take over a decade to recover from those losses, and I'm talking boycotting the entire Republican ticket here, no exceptions. I might just join them. So now you have a choice. Invalidate caucus held over the weekend and hold a fair caucus, or face our wrath in November. Go ahead and cross us at your own peril. You know we are pissed off already by the sheriff votes. Donald Tr J. Trump has received in primary elections held until this point. Think long and hard and ask yourselves, is it worth destroying our entire party for over a decade and suffering a loss that we may never be able to recover? Or is it better to listen to the voters and not let the rhinos GOP elites? Signed, a 53-year-old... Colorado registered Republican voter and Trump supporter. This is why I quit the Republican Party many years ago. Is they screwed uh, Patrick Buchanan out here, and they screwed Patrick Buchanan in New York when the lamb on the ballot. And I was hot. I I went to rejoin the Republican Party for short, but uh, I'm all done with them. These are a bunch of corrupt pieces of dog shit, as far as I'm concerned. Now, here's the reply from the uh, Hood who runs the uh, Colorado Republican Party. I said Hood. Thank you for your note. Go ahead and burn the party down if that's what it takes. Put this country on the right track. Then I am open to anything. What happened over the weekend was simple and had no manipulation or unhanded underhanded process to it. That is a lie. You, you are a liar. Liar, liar, pants on fire. Go to jail. You are a liar. The Cruz campaign worked harder than anyone over a longer period of time using process that we have created. We have to create a victory for him. He went to Colorado and was the only candidate who gave Trump, who did, gave a great speech and won. He didn't win anything, you lying sack of shit.
that is bullshit. I would have been perfectly okay with the result being for Mr. Trump had he and his team done the same thing. You are a liar. Your nose is growing longer, Pinocchio. Once again, what we have here is a uh, serial liar. This guy is obviously a uh, compulsive liar. God, he's as bad as any Democrat. Easily as bad as any Democrat. I'm going to show you a picture of this asshole. Hang on. Alright, here's a picture of the jackass. Uh, that set this up. Now, this is a corrupt piece of human garbage. Make no mistake about it. Uh, he should be completely removed from office and, in my opinion, should be in a jail cell right now. Go to jail. Oh, awaiting trial. Alright, if you want to know what a piece of shit looked like, looks like, that's he. Lastly, the one thing I did not get from Trump supporters who are mad at me right now is why so many believe he isn't going to win. I think Mr. Trump has woken America up and we'll be, we should be thankful for that. <laughs> that is a lie. Why? You are a liar. Liar, liar, pants on fire. He's saying, I don't understand why Trump supporters don't think he's going to win. Well, it's because of dirty, rotten tricks like you. The one you pulled, you asshole. Go to jail. I think Mr. Trump is won't. He has a big lead. He's the easiest path to the nomination, which they intend to steal. A lead in critical states like New York and California, etc. Challenge your energy into getting this guy elected. And in the end, if really manipulation happens, I will be there to fight late in the match for you. You are a lying sack of shit. You are a liar, 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 pants on fire. Deep house. You are a corrupt, worthless piece of human garbage in my book. Unbelievable. Why is this guy not in an orange jumpsuit awaiting trial? Go to jail. So, we're going to take a look at some other stuff. Hang on. Okay, National Border Patrol Council is all pissed off about this as well. And they are challenging uh, GOP to hold a free and fair election. And what's the point of voting? <laughs> 